A mandate from God is a call for an assignment or a distribution of an assignment from God or given an assignment from God. That's the way that I see it. And so the mandate on my life is to help women. Um, there was a time in my life where I actually lived in the valley, literally. Not that I was experienced in the valley, which I was. I was, uh, was um, separated from my children for two years, but I was literally sent seven hours away from Houston to the valley, the Rio Grande Valley. And it was there where the Lord explained to me that the only way I was going to get back home to my children was that I would have to pray my way out, amplify my voice. And so that's what I did for two years. And the call on my life came at that point where I was in the valley. He said, Allison, I am pleased with you. I'm sending you back to Houston to do a great work, to encourage women to be valiant warriors, to, to stand strong in their most difficult times. And so that call came at the worst time of my life. And I'm gonna be honest with you, women of valor, you need to listen. It was the worst time of my life and I could not possibly see how I could be used when I had nothing. The way I got back to Houston, the day before I left to come back from the valley to Houston, my navigator was repossessed. I came back to Houston in a taxi. It cost me $500. But here God was telling me I had a mandate and I didn't have a vehicle. The mandate on your life may not come when things are well. As a matter of fact, I'm for certain it's gonna come at a time when things are just chaotic, when there is no hope, even when your environment looks like failure. But when he calls you out of that, he's literally letting you know that you have an exodus, an exodus out of the valley, out of the wilderness, out of despair out of destruction, out of hopelessness, you have an exodus and that way out is to have faith and confidence in him. And when you take that step and follow him out, your mandate becomes alive. If you obey, your mandate comes alive. You have to obey, women of valor. Wherever he calls you, even in the place where you can't even see that you can be used by God, you've got to stand and make up your mind that you are going to do what he says and accept that assignment. It is that important. Your assignment is that significant. Your assignment is bigger than your name. I'm gonna say that again, your assignment is bigger than your name. And so let your mandate come alive. When he says it to you, you better believe it because he means it. At that appointed time, he will let you know, I trust you to take this assignment forth.